Um, we are by the way the number one convergent player in Europe and the number one fiber player in Europe. And we've decided that uh, in order to better answer to the customer's needs, we, are, uh, we need to be able to provide both mobile and fixed. Historically, in Romania, we were a mobile-only player, and we have, uh, through an agreement, a wholesale agreement with uh, Telecom, uh, a capacity to offer uh, fixed services. Now, if uh, through m &A, in Romania, as in other countries in Europe, we have the capacity to accelerate our capacity to offer very high fixed broadband services to our customers, we will work hard in order to make it possible. Um, and then, if any deal like this uh, <coughs> is to be done, it will obviously require uh, discussions with uh, the other shareholders and the uh, authorities. And I will take first question uh, regarding the Spectrum auction. As we mentioned, we, uh, we do have uh, available Spectrum in C-band, the, the most efficient for 5G, and this is the right uh, thing to, to start, because 5G will be needed in dense areas where, where users uh, need this extensive, uh, extensive connectivity and more capacity. But obviously, for us, uh, uh, an auction which is uh, now postponed for next year is important for a long-term perspective, uh, particularly for 700 uh, megahertz band, the band which will uh, is has higher propensity uh, and accordingly will be used for coverage of less dense areas or for roads, for for instance. So we, uh, we are looking forward to, to see final conditions which will be, um, uh, will be published by ANCOM with uh, all the elements in order to, uh, to decide. But this we see as a mid-long-term journey with usage of uh, 700. 